Hey, welcome back to JF Creations. Today is a quick tip video on how to properly load the knee pads in a pair of black ladder work pants. These load from the bottom, they're a little tricky, but don't worry, I'll show you how it's done. But before we get started, I've gotta get the YouTube troll business out of the way first. So this technically is a sponsored video, although I'm not being paid directly to review these pants. The owner of Trusted Gear Company, that's a store here in Montana that sells this type of clothing, he sells workwear, gave me these pants for the purposes of making review videos for his customers and his website, and obviously for you too. But I needed to let you know that because with YouTube, it gets kind of confusing what is and isn't a sponsored video. I can't figure it out. But anyway, do with that what you will. I was given these, I didn't buy them with my own money, but I do wear them every day at work. So there you go. So if you saw the previous video on the pants I reviewed, like most of the other tech pants out there, there's a flap up here, the open, you just slide the knee pad in the top, it's real easy. These, for some reason, these are great pants, but for some reason, Black Ladder decided that they wanted the knee pads to load up from the bottom, and it's actually kind of a pain, especially if your pants are on, to try to get them in there. Once you get used to it, it's not that big a deal. I'll show you how it's done right here so you don't lose your knee pads. So, on this flap here, you just pull this open and you know what forget this it's too actually too hard to even load these with the pants on I've just been getting used to doing it with the pants off before I put them on so you know what that's what we're going to do I'm gonna take these off so I can show you a little bit better how to do this here all right now that I got those off I can show you this a little bit better so with the black ladder pant the knee pad pouch is just this open flap basically material over the pan itself and what a lot of people were doing is they just take the knee pad slide it in the pouch and then they start walking around and then knee pad just slips out the bottom and i don't know how well you'll be able to see this but in addition to being an open flap they folded the material back in on itself to create this little i don't know what you call it like a little shelf or just a little folded back area that once you slide the knee pad in you need to tuck the bottom edge of the knee pad into that little shelf or pouch whatever you want to call it and that will keep them from falling out they'll stay in there all day long so I'll show you that real quick but what you do is slide the knee pad in and then you tuck the bottom edge of the knee pad in behind that little lip and that knee pad is not going anywhere it'll stay there all day long in fact here let me show you Take the other knee pad, slide it in without tucking it, and we'll do some simulated walking around with these things. So you're going about your business, you're walking around, you're doing your thing, and oops, there goes the knee pad, but that one's still in there. All right, well, that's pretty much it. Hopefully that'll help you out if you have a pair of these or you end up trying a pair so you don't lose your knee pads and start pulling your hair out trying to figure out why these knee pads won't stay in. Just a little design feature to get used to there, but once you do, it's not that big a deal. And uh, if you wanna check these pants out, go to trustedgearco.com. I have affiliate links down in the description below. And I also have a promo code for you. If you use code JFCreations at checkout, you'll get 10% off your order. So get yourself a pair of black ladders and don't forget the umlauts.